A soldier introduces himself to the Peterson family, claiming that he is a friend of their son who died in action. Then, mysteriously, lots of accidental deaths start happening on his arrival. To me, this is the film that Drive should have been. I know a lot of people are suddenly going <gasps> right now, but it, it's how I feel. It is the film that Drive should have been. It had a far interesting lead actor, it, the tone, the execution of the violence, uh, even the electronic soundtrack was better. It just, to me, all those elements just made this fantastic film. And if you love 80s movies, then I think you're gonna love this film. It's very reminiscent of that kind of style. And I absolutely loved and adored how they weren't afraid to explore genres. Horror, thriller, they were mixing it all in there and it worked. You kind of think, surely that cocktail mixture wouldn't work and it does. It's just a wonderful build-up of suspense mixing in all these genres. The cast is great, but my attention just went to Dan Blue Eyes Stevens. Yes, Bradley Cooper, you have lost the title of Blue Eyes now, it goes to Dan Stevens. Just wow, what a transformation that Dan Stevens has done for this role. Like, it's just, you look at him in Downton Abbey with his floppy hair and his sort of aged look. And then in this film, it's six pack, piercing blue eyes, American accent. And it's just like, what happened? <laughs> Yeah, I got a little bit flustered when he came on screen. I was just like, this is not the Downton Abbey Dan Stevens I remember. So yeah, incredible transformation physicality wise, but also his acting was just amazing to me. Like I've never really rated him. And then he came along in this film and it's just like, wow, rising star right there. He just had the intensity just right. It was just perfect. And I, I don't think I really say that often, but I really couldn't fault his performance. His character was just absolutely terrifying. And what was just so wonderful is one moment you're thinking, is he gonna kiss that person or is he gonna just punch them in the face? You just don't know. <laughs> So he really had the character down in the sense of it was just all a mystery and I just think he really, he makes the film. It's all about Dan Stevens to be honest and it is wonderful direction. It's done by the person who did You're Next and it's set in the same universe so look out for a few little clues there. It's just a wonderful piece of work. Uh, Your next was strong, I think this is stronger and I honestly can't wait for his next piece of work because he really just does have this wonderful atmospheric, just the tones, the colours, it's just all beautiful. The guest was certainly a surprise, I absolutely loved it, I loved Dan Stevens, I loved the direction and it's definitely one of my favourites of the year so far. <laughs>